here, YouTube. We're back again today for another Kickstarter critique. I'm here with my amazing wife, Melina. Hello. And we are going to be talking about the stainless steel memo bottle by memo bottle, the water bottle, reimagined, designed flat to fit in your bag and in your life. It's already raised $192,000, and it's currently the fifth most popular project on all of Kickstarter, which is no small feat because it's primarily dominated by games, as you can see. Uh, so they're doing something right here. 27 days left to go. Very excited to see what is propelling this. And I think it's just how unique this is. It's just how do you redesign a water bottle? I really think it's this just this one tagline, very minimalist picture. I would still love to see a price of this water bottle. But what do you think about the main image? I, sorry, I'm more intrigued right now about the almost $2,000 or 2,000 backers and $192,000. Okay. Ooh, it's kind of expensive. So we're looking at a $50 water bottle? Is that, no, it's, I don't know. I don't do math. Um, I think it's fine. It shows me the product. Okay. I mean, does it need to do more? But No, but I'm saying I think that this particular choice is great because it intrigues me. Like, how, how do you redesign a Maybe water bottle? you're calling bottle? that a water bottle. It's like a flask. Either way, I'm excited. As always, when I go to the video, three things. Do I want it? Can you do it? How much is it? Let's go. I said I was going to get that. <laughs> really? <laughs> Come on, guys. It's 2021. <laughs> Seeing these bottles are all gays. Ooh. Seven years ago, we bought you the metal bottle. It was an idea that came about for two reasons. Oh. Single-use water bottles and the disastrous environmental impact. And secondly, the round bottles just didn't fit into our lives. Since then, Memo Bottle has taken the world by storm and has created a massive social and environmental impact. And now... All right, so uh, a little behind-the-scenes thing here. I know this is not their first Kickstarter project. I remember glancing at it. They've done three so far. So okay. I like the fact they're spotlighting that we have a track record. Our products have been featured in all these because, once again, that's helping answer the can you do it, along with, I feel like, what is a very slick video, which I think you're very amused by right now. I'm I'm more impressed with his mustache. Okay. But, okay. yes, no, the videos, once I get past the mustache, like, because his mustache is phenomenal. But once I get past that, yes, it's a very slick video. It does look like a vape as well. You said you thought it looked like a flask. Uh, Noah thinks it looks like a vape. And I personally thought it looked like a. Uh, uh, oh. they were drinking out of cologne. I thought it was like a weird cologne. <laughs> <laughs> I think it kind of looks... a man that doesn't wear cologne. But I know what cologne bottles look now, like. we're ready to give you a whole new reason to go reusable. Introducing the stainless steel memo bottle. A stainless steel bottle Sweet. designed to fit in your bag and in your oh. life. I thought that was a really good shot at the perfect time because, quite honestly, I saw the bottle they were showcasing and I was like, you know what, that's a little bigger than I really want it to be. Did you feel that same way? Yeah, some of the bottles they were handing them were rather large. And now I'm more excited immediately because, like, oh, there's different sizes, different shapes. I think that was a really well-placed shot there. And the ones they were handing them looked like glass. They did. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they did. I can't handle that. Which would not fit in our life. No. <laughs> From handbags to sling bags to backpacks. Big one. Back pockets. Ooh. And even airplane seat pockets. Its flat, paper-inspired design allows to fit next to everything else you carry. It goes where other bottles can't, helping you make the most of the space you have. The stainless steel memo bottle is optimized for carrying and travel, keeping you hydrated on the go, wherever you go. Oh, she stopped. <laughs> Not everybody can walk and drink. With a mouthpiece okay. and a unique internalized thread, it's easy to fill and provides a smooth drinking experience. Hidden thread, how does that work? Look closer and you'll see precision laser etched detailing set against a durable, scratch-resistant powder coat, keeping you hydrated and turning heads for years to come. Premium 304 stainless steel ensures it's always a dream to clean, but for extra peace of mind, drop in a cleaning tablet to refresh your bottle in no time. Okay. Oh, say, I'm glad they brought up the cleaning tablet because I was sitting here looking at these going, how do you clean it? And they said a dream to clean. I'm thinking they mean if you have a dishwasher because... No, it's a dream to clean because they have a cleaning tablet. Oh. That makes it easier to clean it. Mm. It cleans it, the inside of it for you. I so hope you they have still have a it. cleaning brush. Because I gotta say that that I don't know what do you think that diminishes my excitement just a little well, bit. Well, let's knowing. see if they tell us more about the cleaning tablet. Well, I like to speculate early and see if we're correct. <laughs> correct. <laughs> five. The stainless steel memo oh, bottle eight is five, available eight, two six. colors and four convenient sizes. Wherever you are or wherever you go, you'll 
You're bound to find a member bottle fit for any bag and occasion. So what are you waiting for? Pledge today and help us reimagine the humble drink bottle once more. G'day, Jesse and Jono here from Memo Bottle. We are so excited to be back here on Kickstarter for our third campaign. Since our first Kickstarter nice. campaign back in 2014, with your help and our broader community, we've been able to divert over 100 million single-use water bottles from going to landfill. We've also been able to provide over 11 million days of clean water to those in need. We created the stainless steel Memo Bottle to bring you a bottle that is built to last, it saves you space in your bag, and allows you to take water wherever you go. The preparations for mass production are almost complete, but we need your help to bring this state-of-the-art product to life. So please join us on this journey to reduce single-use water bottles. On behalf of the entire Memo Bottle team, thank you. So I love this last part right here. Did a lot of things there. Oof, yeah, having to pay for cleaning tabs kind of sucks. Not many people like to keep paying for a water bottle. And that's, that's what I was I, saying. I would agree. I, I, I get it. Which is why I hope there's a brush. If there's, like, some specific brush you can get instead, I think that's a that's an appealing thing. Um, so they mentioned, you know, we've done three. And the other thing is that this, this gives me a personal touch. I love when they can include a personal touch into the game, which not every Kickstarter does. Sometimes they just feel like you're here to go to a store and buy something. So then having them there, I think it's just a great idea. And overall, I thought I felt like that was a really well done video. That was pretty slick. They held, they definitely held my attention. Do I want it? Yeah, and, and you always have to look at it from the perspective of the people. Who, I always try and look at this from the perspective of someone who might want this product. And so I feel like they did a good job. It. I want to know more about the quality. It, they they've made it sound so far like a product that I did not realize that I needed in my life. Yeah. And that's, that, there you go. That is that is the highest compliment you can give, I would imagine. All right. And because that's, Brit okay. So anyway, three created, eight back. This is where we get a little bit dicey. Always got to check here, make sure it's not a flaming dumpster fire because we are in product design, people, which is the wild, wild west. And for whatever reason, I cannot, uh, ooh, oh, it's a kick booster product. Okay. Which means there might be a kick booster link down below. And if you click on that and buy a memo bottle, I will get a small percentage of it. That being said, I will still give my honest opinion that my track record with Kick Booster products is really, really rough. Oh, what am I doing? <laughs> I don't know. What are you doing? I'm so... Once again, this is only the second time I've shot one of these with my wife, uh, uh, Melina. So, I don't know why I said your name again. And so it gets either. me flustered. I'm off my game because we always like to check the previous things to make sure that they could do the Memo Bottle H2 and then the original Memo Bottle. Because, once again, if these are flaming dumpster fires, if these things are absolute hot garbage, then we got ourselves a problem. Now, 456 backers, I can, or comments, that tells me that this is probably not a flaming dumpster fire. All right. So you're planning to launch a new campaign without closing all orders and inquiries regarding this one. I've checked spam for the rest of my email. Nothing. I can't find the original email uh, sent Ooh. in the single... Well, slow down. This is 2,421 people. So a lot of times if you only have, say, three, four, five of these, it just... And the other thing is, how quickly are they getting to the customer service? Eric, certainly we can do that. It was a direct... Uh, so they are in the customer service. They are responding. Except for this guy. Uh, oh, and they're using the app. And this looks so ugly, and it makes you look so bad. And this is one of the biggest things I always recommend is do not use the Kickstarter app because it does crazy weird things. And so while this should look like this, where it looks like you're responding to people... It does not, and it actually just looks weird. But they are responding to people, it just doesn't look like they are? Yes, and I, I'm pretty sure I've been told that that is exclusive for the Kickstarter app. So, customer support is okay here. About a month ago they decided they were going to do that, but let's actually check and see how long people... Oh, this is That what... sat there for two years? Yes, and this, and now it looks even worse, because I thought this was probably them... Uh, using the Kickstarter Facebook app, but in actuality, it was them trying to probably clog this area so you wouldn't scroll all the way down, which is a ha something I've seen other Kick Booster products do. And damn it, Kick Booster, why do you do this to me? And you've you've heard me rail on Kick Booster before. Have. You've never seen it before. You're getting to see it yeah. firsthand. I hope this doesn't get much worse. I just started using my Slim the last few months with my new bag yesterday. I took it out, and the entire neck had snapped off inside, covering the inside of my bag in water. Ooh. Oh dear God, that's like the worst thing. <laughs> laptops and ipads and cell phones oh my uh, i'd like to get this replaced but i don't see anywhere on the site get bent eric <laughs> oh no at fellow backers who here has also never received their rewards and no response from memo bottle to any attempt at contacting them to get an update in a oh my two God. years ago and then they responded a month ago but nobody else responded to it that is something very important to note it's true 
which but he kept trying i still have not received my rewards uh hi i, I ha have everyone got the refund message from kickstarter because i haven't received one and i'm very worried Did this not happen what the... <sighs> we're going on a journey dear new kickstarter yeah, uh we've oh and then oh, why hide it why do you need to hide your updates why do you have to hide your updates this looks bad this always looks bad uh, but here's the thing. It's not a flaming dumpster fire in here. You don't see a massive amount of comments, which you would typically see if someone had this absolutely god-awful product, which is, this is really weird. This is a really weird one, because this is 2,400 people. I'm going to check the comment section one time, but we need to go look at the other memo bottle, because that, that did not make me feel comfortable. <laughs> it did make me feel, yeah, that's weird. All right, so let's check out the comments here. Uh, just starting using my Slim Bottle from the Kickstarter. I love it, but today, after four months, the neck broke of the bottle, and it leaked all over inside the bag. Is there a way to get this replaced? So, Eric was so frustrated. <laughs> he was on... Both? Yeah. Okay. He's commented on both. This and was over a year ago. And they still ignored him. Um, that's like, that's an immediate F on the customer service I'm seeing here. New spammy update received from you. I love your product, but I guess I'll report you to Kickstarter for spamming. <laughs> Uh, okay. You don't monitor the comment wall, but you keep spamming us. Please stop. Now, that is actually a fair point. You're not even going to... Oh, this is bad. Uh, please note that the comment wall is no longer being monitored. If you have any queries about your Kickstarter from 2014 or about memo bottles, please... Uh, okay. I, I no wouldn't trust these guys. Back their first A4 memo bottle, they sent me the cheapest, nastiest piece of plastic I've ever seen. It looked like the kind of plastic used on a milk carton. Foggy, soft, and bendy. I don't know if they accidentally sent me a prototype or something, but when I addressed the problem to them, they pretty much said, bad luck, better next time, it's hard to make those. Uh, oof, yeah, have it, uh, this response to Eric is directly above his post. Sounds like a possible design flaw. It's right above his post. What? Go back up. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, so it got 11 months up. later, though. Like, still, that's that's an F on customer service. I mean, I guess you could say that's a D-, minus because, you know what? I'll go D-. minus. I think it's fair. You turned it in, Billy. You turned it in. You're in seventh grade now, but you turned it in. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, okay. So I I feel very, like, I, I think we've dug enough here. Let's go back to the excitement, dear. <laughs> so, okay. and this is why the grading these is always so difficult. Um, uh, okay, so, but once again, fresh eyes, forget everything you've seen, we're still, we're still providing critiques and thoughts on the page, and I know well, maybe, maybe the stainless steel one is just them trying to fix all of their design problems. Potentially. I'm not risking my money, though. They're not trying to make it out of plastic. <clears throat> Let's see. They're that that is a solid point. stainless steel. A bottle designed to fit in your bag and life, you shouldn't have to think twice about bringing water. That's why we're reimagining the humble water bottle to always fit in your bag in your life. Seven years ago, we brought you the original memo bottle. Is this something I click on? What is this? I have no idea what that is. It looks weird. It says L Sep. What the hell? I'm thinking it's supposed to be something and then it didn't become anything. I'm going to see if it's on my end or on their end, because I am running a computer from 1974. Uh, now the memo bottle yeah. is back with a brand new look. And yes, it does look sleek. Designed it to fit, does. made to travel, built to last. And then this is a very common kick booster trope that we're going to see, where we are going to see that video regurgitated back, baby birded into our mouth, with a few extra little snippets brought in. So every single video you see from this point on is pretty much just going to be stolen straight from that video. It's a very common thing uh, amongst kick booster products, which I find very interesting. Five months of clean water access. Every memo bottle is sold provides five months of water. So this is actually where they're going more in depth That's about nice. the thing at the end, which is great. They did mimic that mention that, but is it the first thing I want? So do I want it? I did. The video had me, you lost me with the, can you do it? And can you do it is now at a very, you know, Physically, you might be able to do it, but I feel like can you do it also factors in the customer service. And if you have an issue, do you want to deal with these people? Like, no. from what you've seen? Not, not from looking at their past. Nah, me neither. So that one's not doing so well. How much is it that's the last thing I need? But if you wowed me with a $30 price tag, like at that point, it's like, ah, eh, what the hell? 30 bucks. I think it's going to really hinge on the price tag, this this page. But it's already raised 100 and something Yeah, but I thousand. haven't seen a price yet. Yeah, you're right. We should probably Which get that. problem. Hi. Oh, my God. This is why I married you. Reduce your single-use impact one bottle. Okay, so this is great. We've been spotted. And this is always terrible. I hate when you do this. I didn't mind it so much in the video. I can't read them. You can, well, it's, this is also just the name of places. And a lot of the times, so let's actually do the test. And I like to do the sniff test because we already know this is probably not something you're probably going to back. Let's see what Forbes actually said about the memo bottle. How about bottle. you type it? Uh, 
correctly. Because a lot of time, these Forbes, the, like a lot of these articles are nothing but puff pieces. Talk Ted gets chained. Uh, okay. Okay, so no, this is actually someone talking about the memo bottle and S2 and how much they loved it. 2016. Ah, uh, interesting. The plot thickens. I still like when they click these, uh, when they make them clickable. Designed to fit anywhere. Oh, I've seen that before. Make the most of your space you have. Made for travel. Born from a desire to roost the thing. Built to last. It's all in the details. And this is why I just... Uh, and so, what are they regurgitating all this? Just in case you didn't watch the actual video, forty percent of people don't watch the video, um, so, and I get it. But I still think here's the thing: I, I assume that the forty percent of people who don't watch the video, based on my polling, are people who get more down to business. And if they're the kind of people that get more down to business, why not just give them the price anyway? If they're already getting more down to business, it's hard for me to want this because I have a backpack, but the sides of the backpacks have the water bottle holders that are round and designed for normal water bottles, and it's it's away from my electronics. That's a solid point. Like just I, it is. that one comment right there was like the worst comment ever. It snapped off in my bag and it's just like, no, like, no, I, I don't want to take a risk at all now. Yep. Uh, so we have the different ones, the a seven, which, uh, it doesn't actually give you the sizes either, which I think is really odd and like, cool. I like knowing the size, like to it's drink. It's eight ounces, but I want to know dimensions. I think the dimensions. Is it like for me? Is it going to fit into my purse? Because this looks like a product that would be really great for me. Yes. Because like, I don't typically keep my phone in my purse anyway. I usually carry it. Mm -hmm. So like, there's nothing in my purse that if it gets wet, that's fine for me personally. Well, what they're trying to do, I think, is but quite... I don't know if it's going to fit. Well, look close. Like, they're putting it next to another bag, but you still don't know the size of this bag. And I like, mean, I've that, got a pretty good size of it considering her hand, but, you know. Could be a stunt hand. I still want the dimensions. I don't understand the hype. It's literally just a flask. <laughs> you can both what go, I said. You can go buy one right now, not pay shipping, not have to wait for it, and get your choice of tons of designs slash materials and options. You've got a You're point. You're not wrong. <laughs> And you don't have to have tablets to clean it out. <laughs> you got flash sure. tablets. All right. Uh, so cool. We're going over it. The cleaning tablets. Give your bottle a superior clean with a memo bottle cleaning tablet. We recommend once a month. Okay. So it's a 12. Uh, and you get it available in the six month supply. Mm. Six tablets. Yeah. But for how much? Yeah. Price would be nice. Oh, oh look, there's now the dimensions. We do, but once again. Can, Millimeters. Oh, and oh, they inches. did. They did Good. convert it to inches, which is one thing that I think is not, needs to be interesting. I was going to say, I am American. I need inches. And and once again, most of the people who back on Kickstarter, 654. United States, Australia Australia's supporting their well, own. Also That's awesome. from Australia. Oh, I wonder if they're going to have some sexy shipping if you're in the given, uh, Australia. Given the uh, accents. Mm. So, premium stamp is still leak-proof lid. And that's the other thing. I really want to see how the inside of this lid works. That's my biggest personal question. It, it, well, they showed a shot of it. It's literally on the inside. The, the I, what, are, what are they called? But I want to see someone... I just want to see the... And this is what I always mention on the kick, these kick booster ones, because they rarely ever have it. I want to just see someone physically using the prototype. Just, like, set up in front of a camera phone. Hey, this is Todd. Here's what we're doing. We're going to put it in water. I'm going to dump it. I'm going to squeeze it. And, do, do, do. and it's just, you don't see those videos on product design nearly enough. And I think Somebody they literally send it to to just go test this for us. Or even if it's them. It. Like, I don't care if it's in an, like. Right. Like, if it's just, because the, the product design is just different from board games in a lot of different ways. And so, yeah, $37. So here's the bottom line. If $37 is the lowest price you have, I would quite personally put on that beginning main image, which I both think we thought was pretty sexy, you know, 37, starting at $37, you know, now granted that's an early bird price, but this is probably gonna have early bird prices for the entire time. Cause that's also another kick booster thing. I don't understand the hype. Yeah. It's no, still, it, <laughs> but it makes me laugh again. <laughs> uh, so 37, 39, 49, 44, 12. I do think the price is to a point, assuming we haven't seen the shipping where if you had enough money, you'd say, all right, I'm just going to risk it. You know, it's not like if it, if, it, if it ends up not working, it's what, 45 bucks out of my pocket. I, I don't know. He's got a point. I can just go buy a flask and I know it's not going to leak all over everything. That is fair. That is fair. But once again, like the people that come to this, this, this particular page might not have that mindset. That's true. <laughs> like if you, like if your first thought is, why don't I just use a flask? Cleaning. This is probably not what you're clicking on. <laughs> Cleaning tablets. I have to pay $2 per tablet. Okay, so that's $2 a month. I think I'd rather find a different way of cleaning it. Extra lid, available as an add-on. Why do I need an extra lid if your lid's so nice? Okay, uh, the Duo. 
That was made for people that buy $5 Voss water and not the normal plastic water bottle. The fancy water drinkers. I could say, you know what? I actually... I mean, he's got a point, too. I think you hit that on the head there, Noah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, what do we got? Stuff, timeline, when's it coming out? September. Wow. September, November, final week, mass production, December, freight to localized warehouses. So it's coming in May. All right. I don't have an issue with that. I do like the fact they're mentioning that. Um, I just need the shipping. That's all I, mean, I need. I it's nice that they've got a timeline, but they... I don't, I don't know. Go ahead. So, this is kind of odd. Selling just the cleaning tablets, and I'm assuming limited early bird offer. Six months of water cleaning. Well, because so many people were so happy with their previous bottles that they just want the cleaning tablets. Oh, 17. Maybe that's it. Okay. And then, so we have the stainless steel memo bottle. 59 people want the small one. This is going to be broken up into all the different sizes. Uh, 505... 357, 315. And so these are pretty good pledge levels. That tells me they're hitting the head on what sizes people want because if this was like two, you'd be like, oh, well, you clearly well, I mean, don't need it. They're pretty standard one. sizes for what's already out there mm. in the plastic bottle. Oh, yeah, bottles. I guess they could just base it off that, couldn't they? All right. Uh, no, that's exactly what they did. Well, they're also. <laughs> Oh, and the shipping is over here. So here's one thing I oh. always... Yeah, that's super nice. It's not typical on board games. Uh, but if, Yeah, no, you had to have a little chart on the one that we looked at. Yeah. If your shipping is calculated on the right side, I always think you need to mention that to the people and say, hey, it's mentioned over there. Because once again, uh, you know... Let's see how many new people. So 352. That's actually a decent amount of new people. Uh, but yeah, I would I would always mention that because that's a selling point as well. It just makes everything clicker and cleaner. So $97 for this water bottle. That's a... That's a lot. <clears throat> All right, so about us. Well, for the duo, you're getting two of them. Oh, okay, okay. And this is the kind of item you're going to have for the rest of your life. You do need to look at it from that mindset. We're committed to inspire a more reusable society through the design of considered convenient everyday products. Memo bottle was founded in 2014. A mission in a bottle. Okay, cool. This is more about the cool stuff about you. Awesome. So, okay. I mean, I like the fact that they do throw in <clears throat> that you are helping to provide clean water for people that need it. Because if you are a person that is probably looking at realistically buying this product in the first place, that is probably something that is going to pique your interest. Mm, yeah, you're appealing straight to your niche. Also, you know that people who are probably buying this item probably have more disposable income, and if you have more disposable income, you're more likely to want to contribute to things like this that are, you know, planting trees and doing the water stuff. Market into the niche, but then again, this is their third time around. I should suspect that, I guess. Uh, oh, and I love this. This is what I'm talking about right here. This is the way I would love to see industry standard made, where I know that this is about the rewards, this is about the product, this is about the oh, shipping. Oh, that is nice. Yeah, it is, and everyone should do it. <laughs> like, it just, shipping, Not just bam. listing the questions. You, you automatically go to the section you're looking for. Yeah, and, and the bottom line is, it's really quite easy. You have all these FAQs. You're going to type them out anyway. Just put them in a specific order and slap the word shipping or returns in front of them. And I just think that is, this is the way. Uh, all right, updates. One, so we launched August 17th, three days. Wow, no excitement whatsoever. This is a terrible update, and you can tell because you They're are talking. not engaging. Yeah, you're talking to a room of 1,957 people who want to support your product and support you because, once again, you included the personal touch. One comment? One comment. What do you know about their backers? You know they are interested in a water bottle. You know they're probably green. You know they're. I mean, they should be. Engaging. Talking, yes, and talking about even possibly, like, random things, like you've said before. Where are you going to take it? First question. Slam dunk. But, like, the, the, the water that is helping the people, like, the drinking, the safe drinking water. Mm -hmm. Oh, you yeah. You to be talking about, about that. that. You can talk about anything. You can talk about how chances many... chances are you're going to get, like I said, a lot of your people probably actually care about that if they're realistically looking at buying this thing. Yeah. You could see you you are a better update writer than they are because once again they're just regurgitating things. Uh, poll idea. Well, thank you. That's working. All right. Uh, not has the stainless steel memo <laughs> bottle with response fund in a few minutes. Nineteen hundred. Yada yada. Now let's do this. We're serious about meeting our projected timeline and have everything in place to help us get us here. We assume that. Like, why would you lie? <clears throat> Communication. It's all about transparency. Oh, communi Oh, is it now? Because you took a whole year to respond to other people on your other ones. Things are different, dear. Things Two years different. on the other one. <laughs> We're conscientious not to bombard you with multiple updates on every milestone and every element, but we want you to be on the journey with us all the way through. 
Whether it be for production wins or production hurdles, you'll be a buyer. So during the live campaign, we'll be sharing infrequent updates, highlighting some of these exciting milestones about the campaign itself. So I don't mind this, the fact that they're saying, hey, we're not going to bug you too much. But then again... <clears throat> well, but see, here's the thing, though. Like, as a backer, I don't you kind of want a comprehensive, like, not, hey, today we ran into this issue, this issue, and then the next day you're like, oh, well, we've got this issue again. Like... Once a week, once a month, however frequently it should be. I agree. Like a comprehensive, hey, this is what we're doing, and this is how we are trying to resolve whatever issues we have. Industry standard, I would say, is most likely at least once a week, and then after the campaign's over, at least once a month. Uh, Which is pretty much what you just said. But it needs to be comprehensive, right? No, not necessarily. Well, everybody does updates differently. That's what I would want, especially out of a product like this. And, and that, once again... With their history, if I'm actually going to take the plunge and back this, I want comprehensive yeah. okay. information. Like, I, I, I want to know exactly what you're doing and exactly how you're trying to solve it, because I backed you. I just want a question. I just, I'm more concerned about you tickling the Kickstarter algorithm. She's talking from <laughs> someone who wants that, and so there's going to be... And so, here's the bottom line... You are someone who's going to be really easy to get brand loyalty from just by doing an awesome job. You're going to be more likely to back a company if they made you feel good about all that. Well, yeah. Yeah. I mean, that goes that goes without saying for anything. Mm -hmm. Yeah, true. And their hit past history is not inspiring. Inspiring. Uh, so now they're talking a little bit more of the, the, help us spread the word together. We've started this campaign amazingly, but we have a long way to go in order to create. If you could please share the word with your friends and family. Thank you. So they're just, they're saying how just share this. No one's going to share this super, super, super from France. Okay. So this is one person who's that super excited about it. But other than that, nobody engaged because you didn't ask for any engagement. So 103 comments. Let's check it out. They don't care about the engagement. Hi, guys. Considering the bottle is not insulated, will filling it with hot water make the bottle too hot to hold in case of cold water? Will it sweat? Hopefully they get to that. It looks like they are responding to these, which is good. Is that a yellow flat-coated retriever on your team? I don't know what that means. And these people just commented, not, you know, today. Yeah, eight hours. So that's not too bad. Yeah. Uh, Does it do it out, Glenn? Because, I mean, people sleep. People got jobs. Granted, you should, actually, in this case, this is your probably job, but you still sleep. Does the new metallic lid are good for hot water. The old one was just a plastic cap stuck in a metallic cap. <laughs> Hi, backers. We are signing off today here in Australia. Thanks for another great day of the campaign and all your support. I really like the concept of the flat design. This is my fifth time to back a beverage container on Kickstarter, and the stainless steel paper-inspired look really caught my eye on this one. This is yet the best design of the memo bottle line, and I'm stoked to be a part of it. If no one has suggested a fitted leather pouch as a future offer, even after the campaign ends, I think this would be a great, classy accessory. That, that, um... I mean, I get it. Yeah, this looks... This backer looks... Yeah. Sometimes you see backers, and, and what I'll do is I'll go back through previous comment section. You'll see what look like might she's be... she's placed? Perhaps. I'm not going to make that assumption yet, she's but if picked. I see Farah popping up more frequently and saying things that the company would most likely like to say, like, hey, you guys should charge us for bags. Okay. <laughs> Uh, oh, wow. I just saw your previous campaign for the Memo Bottle H2O, and you introduced the range of premium accessories. Maybe you can design an upgraded leather sleeve to complement. Oh, yeah, we want more stuff. Hi, Farrah. That's awesome to hear. Thanks for your support. I appreciate the feedback. It's interesting to hear all the suggestions for similar accessories to match this range as well. Again, these are on our radar. Maybe a part. Uh, hi, I checked the water bottle stand for sale on your website, and they are all sold out. Can you set us a water bottle stand with stretch goal? Interesting. I agree with what the bottle well stand would be great after the campaign ends. Dot, dot, dot. Oh, Farrah wants them to get more things for her to spend money on. Interesting. Cool. Not, not yet. One more, and I then I'm one more. Uh, sorry, this may have been answered before. I see two different looking bottles mocked up, the A5 and A6. So here's the one thing that does make me feel a little bit comfortable. This is not a flaming dumpster fire. I don't see the people like, oh, you know, you're so trying far, to... So far, they're, they're on it. Which means maybe we just caught the worst of the worst on the customer service, but we were digging a little bit too much on the sinister of the product design. Well, and again, I go back to my previous thought of maybe on this time around, they are legitimately trying to fix all of the flaws from the previous ones. I hope they were doing the second design, time around, too. <laughs> well, design-wise and then customer service-wise. So you're hoping I'm that third time's hoping, the charm. yes. Okay. Um, at the end of the day... Because I want to like them. I do as well. So at the end of the day, we got to give it a grade, though. A through F. Do I want it? Yes, just straight from the water bottle perspective, I do. I would like this. If it, if it worked exactly the way it said, I think it's a cool-looking product. Can you do it? 
that's where I'm a little bit more concerned. I was on, I was, I said an F, but then I moved it to D minus, and I'm going to stick with a D minus. I'm going to stick with a D minus, even though, and that's just mostly for customer service. I'm sur- because I'm not seeing a flaming dumpster fire here. We have thousands yeah. of people with the product. They're not coming in. They're not complaining. And what's also important to note is I do believe that they know that the product is going up. So let's, yeah, because once again they said, hey, we got a new thing. We got a new thing. So let's see. I want to read these six comments right here. Yeah. So there's only six. I got mine, but had issues with sparkling water. Again, no replies to email. So freaking excited for this launch, guys. Yeah, I still got, I got to go D minus on that. And then how much is it? Price. I think it's reasonable if you look at it from a lifetime, a lifetime bottle. Yeah. I'm Final not grade? too fond of the cleaning tablet thing. Final grade. I really got to go pee. That's what I'm saying. I have C minus. C minus. Just because like, I want to give them the benefit of the doubt. Yeah, I'm going to give a C- minus as well. thought the video was slick. I thought they did a really good job. The customer service scared the living daylights out of me. But if you're willing yeah. to take that plunge, then go check out the Stainless Steel Memo Bottle, which may or may not have a kick booster link down below. And as always, if you're enjoying this kind of content, please be sure to click on the subscribe button down below. Thanks for your time, YouTube. Uh, bye-bye.